Okay, here's the Yamaha EF 2400 IS inverter that I'm taking apart. Uh, it's fairly new, it was working fine, and uh, basically it just locked up. I thought maybe there was something here in the uh, generator part, uh, nothing I can see yet. But I'll get it farther apart. It's very easy to uh, get it in pieces. You can see the uh, cover is sitting there. They all just, uh, there's little uh, places where they pop in. Actually, there's a clip right there. So they have little clips on them. Same thing on the top. You just pop them, uh, pull a few screws, for example, and then it just uh, sits in here, pops into those clips. Getting the uh, gas tank off was easy. Just pull the uh, hose. Uh, there's four bolts here on the top. Uh, which you can see on the top of the gas tank. Uh, the cover is just a rubber piece. It just pops out of the hole there. And you can slip that top off. And uh, this piece over the exhaust, it just has a few uh, screws in it. So there's a screw here, there, there, and then on the outside here, there's another cover with a few uh, small screws, which are right there in the pan. There's your screws for your cover. Now on the gas, uh, it has a screw down inside. That's your uh, thing to turn the gas on and off for your valve. And then there's the uh, three screws that uh, are fit on the little fan right here. You can see three screws there where the side uh, fan fit on. So very easy to get down to where I'm at right now, getting the covers off. Uh, probably going to pull this front uh, cover off as well. Uh, some wires and stuff, but uh, I don't think it's going to be that difficult to pop it out of there. Maybe there's a few screws or something I have to pull out to get that out of there. And then we'll be able to see a little better. Mainly just took this for me, so I can kind of remember as I go along. But uh, it's a nice little generator was so we'll see how it turns out thanks